Hi, I'm John Lanius, president of Vidza Media, part of the Nitrous Effect Collective of Companies, and welcome to The Leadership Factor, where we shine the light on people doing great things in our community. I'm joined now by Andrew Glantz. He's the founder and CEO of gift to meal and I've had the pleasure of knowing him for a couple of years. Andrew, how are you? Doing all right, just kind of braving the storm like everyone else, and you know, all things considered, making it through. Yeah, absolutely. You know, uh, I love what you're doing for the community, and uh, those who don't know, uh, how has give to meal adapted to the COVID-19 crisis? So typically the way gift to meal works is we're a free mobile app and each time somebody takes a photo at one of our apartment restaurants, we make a donation to a local food bank to give a meal to someone who needs. That's Operation Food Search here in St. Louis. With the COVID-19 crisis, dine-in was closed. And so gift to meal couldn't be used in the same fashion anymore. So we pivoted the app in order to allow people to take a photo of their takeout, delivery, or gift card purchase from one of our partner restaurants in order to give a meal to someone. That way they could still support these local restaurants while also giving back. Got it. And you've kind of indicated some of this, but how can people watching specifically use gift a meal to, to help during this crisis? Uh, I'd absolutely encourage you to order from our partner restaurants. You can download the app for free, and actually every person that downloads the app would give a meal to someone who through Operation Food Search right off the bat. Uh, and then you can scroll through a list of our partner restaurants. We have uh, filters on the app where you can sort by restaurants that are open for curbside pickup, normal takeout, delivery, gift card purchases, or whether they're temporarily closed. And so if you could help support our local restaurants that are partnering with Gift and Meal during this crisis, that would be terrific and you'll be able to help them while also helping the community who take your picture on Gift and Meal. That's great, Andrew. You know, we've been interviewing leaders from all around the world, and some of those interviews have gone out publicly. Some of them have gone just to their specific communities. But, uh, you know, this is one that's going to go out really to the Internet and, and all over the world. And so I'd like to ask you, for you as a leader, someone who's been committed uh, to, you know, Gift a Meal for a, for a long time, what are some words of inspiration or what's your favorite quote right now? Uh, I mean, I would say that my biggest word of inspiration that are kind of getting me through this is uh, the, the timeline of what we're in right now is going to be a very short time we look at in the rest of our lives. And uh, in the greater scheme of things, we're going to be able to make it through and we constantly face challenges, uh, but we can look to overcome them and there can be innovations that can result. So with Gift Me in particular, I'm looking to see how can we best be helping people that are going to be most affected during this crisis so that way they can help make it through. Andrew Glantz, founder and CEO of gift a meal How can people find you online? People can go to gift meal.com or you can just go to the App Store or Play Store, type in gift a meal and download our app. Um, you can also find us on Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter at gift a meal Thank you, Andrew. Once again, Andrew Glantz, founder and CEO of gift a meal as we wrap this interview, I'd like to leave you with a quote as I leave you with after every one of these interviews. And this one is, the strongest people are not those who show strength in front of us, but those who win battles we know nothing about. And that couldn't be any more true right now. My name is John Lanius. I'm the president of Vidza Media, part of the Nitrous Effect Collective of Companies, and we'll have more interviews soon on The Leadership Factor. Thank you for joining me. 